Here we're looking at the Soundcore Liberty True Wireless Headphones. Anchor is behind the Soundcore brand, of course. They are just using the brand name Soundcore for all their audio related equipment. So let's check out the physical part of this first. The case is relatively large by today's standard, but it's very well built. And the reason why it's so big is it has 100 hours of battery life. Case open this way. And it's very secure, so it's not going to shake open. The e buttons are attached by magnets, of course. And again, they're not going to come out. So, but they do pop out quite easily. You can see that there is a uh, piece there that made with the magnet here. So it would go in with a good snap. So the case is very well designed. how easy it is for, to put it back and one cool thing is to check the batteries level you just shake the case and the light will come out there the earbuds the size are kind of average by today's standards there are smaller ones but there are some way bigger ones as well there is a physical button on each side and they press in reasonably softly so on some brand they're so hard that if you press it the whole thing gets jammed into the ear which is not comfortable in this case the buttons are fine so on the control basically you have single press double press or long press the single press on either one is your typical play pause call and answer etc and a long press on one side skip to the next track and the long press on the other side skip to the previous track double press though will invoke um, Siri in my case on the iPhone. And then there's this whole sequence where if you hold it down for five seconds and so forth and so forth, you can actually reset these headphones. On the battery life, as mentioned before, they have 100 hours rated battery life. And I've used this set on an extended trip for about a week. So multiple plane rides, multiple calls, and this is still on its first charge. So between the case and the earbuds, um, the battery does last a long time. One thing to note that is the connection, it's between the earbuds and then from one earbud to the device. So you cannot use one at a time, which means you're not able to charge one and use the other one in the swap and charge the other one like the iPods or uh, some other brands. But that's fine because as I said, this thing has lasted pretty much forever so far. The earbuds are very comfortable. It comes with um, different size of ear tips and also these guys, it has wings on them. And honestly, they fit so well that I don't really need them. These are the medium sized ear tips and they seems to fit well. And they are in ear. So it's inside your ear, it's quite comfortable. It doesn't fall off even during exercise. And because of, because of the fact that they're in ear, the um, sound isolation is very good. So on a plane, while they are not ANC, they do cut out most of the engine noise. As I said, this is Bluetooth 5.0. The range is pretty good, and they do pair to multiple devices. They start pairing when you remove them from the case. So what you want to do is take them out, go to your device, and initiate the, um, the connection. If you want to pair the second one, then make sure the first device is switched off. When you lift these things out, it will then pair to the second one and so forth. Finally, the sound quality. They are These are only 5.6 millimeter drivers according to the website. So doesn't seem that they are that large driver for sound quality wise, but they actually sound pretty, pretty good. Um, it's actually quite enjoyable. It comes fine uh, when I first used them, so no burns in. Uh, the bass are reasonably good for something this size. I think the fact that they are in ear makes a difference. So because of the sound isolation, um, they sound very good. So not bad for sound quality and the call quality is also pretty good. So this part of the review, I'm recording actually off the earbuds, so that's why you don't see them here. I'm going to show you the case. This is the charging port. So this is the only thing, right? This is a headphone coming out in mid-2019, and it still uses micro USB. But other than that, as I said, I really like this set. The packaging is quite premium.
right? So specs in the bag. As I said, it comes with a full set of accessories, which I removed. All right, but here, it's instructions, charging cables, and so forth. And these are all the different ear tips and wings that comes with it. And there we have it. So, so I think you agree that the mic quality is actually pretty good as well. Overall, it's a pretty nice pair of headsets. It's a little bit cheaper from the other name brand, and the performance honestly is quite good.